What's up guys, my name is Raquel. If you don't know who I am, now you do, because my name's Raquel, it's not Rachel. People keep calling me Rachel, it's not, it's not Rachel, okay? But, I just filmed this lovely video for you guys of how to drive sick, and my seat was not hooked, and they kept just flopping, and I didn't even notice. I heard it, you could like see, like I looked back, I was like, what is that? But, I had no idea. And it's really bothering me because you just see the background just waving. So, here we go again on how to drive sick. Our GoPro on. Okay. So, when you first get into a manual car, obviously mine's on right now. I'm not going to turn it off because I'm having trouble with my car starting. Uh, I need to replace my ground wire, so apparently it's fried off, and my car won't start when it's hot. It'll start on a cold start, but it won't turn on when it's hot, so I need to replace that this weekend. But, yeah, so when you would first get into a car, I want you first to... first get comfortable with the shifter so obviously the car's on I need to put the clutch in but here second gear to third to fourth to fifth six and then reverse first here straight down second a little bit over third straight down fourth okay got the point neutral make sure the e-brake is up if you're not pressing the gas we're gonna do this again Make sure you get your hand sanitizer. You know, guys, you gotta sanitize everything. These people are gross. But, so first you're gonna put the clutch in, put your foot on the brake, let go of the e-brake. You're gonna put it in first gear, okay? Then, you ready, you can go, let go of the brake. You might roll a little bit, let go of the clutch, give it a little bit of gas. Once the car starts, no, oh, there's a stop sign, never mind. Put it back in. Okay, so you're gonna give it a little bit of gas, let go of the clutch, and then once the car starts going, then let go of the clutch. Don't rest your foot on it, don't ride the clutch. If you give the car, I'm coming up to your stop sign, so clutch in, put it in neutral, let go of the clutch. Just use spray. So, if you give it too much gas all the time and not enough of the clutch, then you are going to ride your clutch and then your clutch is going to be bad. So, first gear, come on the brake, give it a little bit of the gas, give it a little bit of the clutch, and then go. 3,000 RPMs, second gear, same thing, let go of the clutch, give it a little bit of gas, put the clutch in, third gear.
don't have to downshift. You can literally just put it in neutral. Just make sure you don't keep your foot on the on the clutch. So you'll get used to it. You just give it a little bit. Of, you let go of the clutch just a little bit, and then you give it a little bit of gas. And then once the car starts going and it's good to go, then just let go of the clutch slowly. How you like when you, it feels comfortable, just slowly let go of it. Don't pull out of the clutch really fast. Now, to really like get the hang of your clutch, when you're on a red light and you just let go of the clutch just a little bit without giving any gas, you can literally feel where it'll catch. Don't let go of it completely, but you know. And hand sanitize. So if I let go of the clutch with no gas, see how it can, it'll still move without giving it any gas. I haven't bought a gate code or a gate clicker.